I think we're gonna do a live dig. I'm kind of bouncing between 26 and 30. I'm hoping either an old coin or silver green. Alright, keep going. Now yeah, we got a banger right here. I was blowing my eardrums up. 30. Probably just a hiring in quarter, but let's find out together. That <laughs> is a silver quarter. Awesome. God, that's in good shape. Just barely made it. 1964. Not to rub on it too much. Man, that's a beautiful specimen. Look at that. Gotta love that. All right. Let's see what else we can get. You know, I've hammered this beach over and over and over and over. I can't even believe that this is still out here for me to find. I did hit most of this beach with the uh, AT Max and AT Pro. But what the heck? That's crazy. You guys want a live dig at 1112? Let's do it. This is probably a nickel. Or a pull tab. But we're hoping it's a gold ring. Yeah, it's got two of them. Yeah, beaver tail. Well, life of a gold ring hunter. You dig a ton of these, but I'll tell you what, you dig enough of them, eventually it's a gold ring. We should do this one live. I got a 30. I took one little scoop, but I haven't seen anything. So it's probably a quarter. Man, I didn't see a quarter fall. Did you guys? Oh yeah, there it is. Oh, it was a quarter. Alright, just a glad one this time, but... All right, Let's see what else we can get. All right, I think I got something cool here. This was a 18. It's like a little piece of jewelry. Well, I think that's going to be a bling. But look at that little pendant. All right, let's keep going. All right, I got a high town here. Finally, what I've been taking is a million of those uh, head stamps. I think one of them's a gold ring. So far, I just have a pouch full of head stamps. Oh, I don't have tone yet. Man, it must be deep. Hold on. Let me get down there a little, get you back in. Okay, I got tone finally. I have not seen what this is. I mean, it's probably just cloud. Let's find out together. Yep, cloud quarter. Wow, look at that. Is that what I think it is? This is so deep. I can barely hear it. Now let me wash it up. Well, 
probably isn't what I think it is, but I'm wondering if that's like a Civil War era style bullet. You guys tell me. A lot of the Civil War guys came straight to Montana to uh, you know do the gold rush right after the Civil War. Huh. I've never dug one that looks like that here. Crazy. Oh man, I think I got something good here. I do not know what it is. Oh. Look at that. It's a Merc. Alright. Let me wash it up. Let's see what here it is. Oh man, look how pretty that is. There's a lot of meat left on that one. 1943. Awesome. Alright. I guess we're still pulling some old silver out of here. I've been over this a zillion times, but, you know, it's a big area. Like, I'll give you a little scan. So, it's easy to miss something. Alright, let's see what we can get. Haha. Uh -huh. Blinkay got me a ring. Oh, dude. Look at that. Let's wash it up. Alright, let's reveal it together. That <laughs> is amazing. Look at that. Oh, it's probably a blink now. Let's see. That's crazy. What is going on with this ring? Let me look at these marks. Yep, it's 925, all right. It's weird though, because it almost looks like fashion jewelry, or costume jewelry. But I think what it was, is I think it was gold-plated silver. And, wow, well, I just, I don't have one like that. It's crazy. Boom. <laughs> oh man, I must have dug. 40 of those head stamps at least finally one of them was a nickel just a plain nickel but well, that feels good well that's an interesting little thing anybody know what that is so i sure don't i think it's aluminum it's got little teeth in the sun hopefully you guys can see that what do you think Sort of weird old relic, huh? Okay, I think I just dug me a little button. I decided to walk over to the water and wash it up. So I could show you guys. Yeah. It's not too awfully old, but maybe what, 30s or something. Alright. See what else we can get.